an unwavering commitment to fueling innovation that ultimately impacts patient care. Through research, Research in plastic surgery is very exciting. Every time you go into the operating room and use some piece of technology or some piece of mesh or whatnot, that all came through research. If you look at technologies for body contouring, if you look at technologies for stem cells, if you look at nerve grafting, you look at face transplants, every single one of these things came from research. There is not a successful corporation in the world that doesn't have a line item for research and development. The R&D is the foundation. Through innovation. Plastic surgery does live and die by uh, our innovative capability. Innovation is the bloodline of creating techniques and mediums that uh, are novel and uh, create efficiency in what you do. Really, the PSF, in many ways, is, is the engine, or rather the generator of the engine for our future. Through training. Training should be a lifelong quest to improve the education of plastic surgeons, the ancillary people who help us, and also the public. Through humanitarian efforts. I've been going down to the Dominican Republic uh, to perform cleft surgery, burn reconstruction, and ear reconstruction uh, since 2000. I always call it the, the week of unadulterated good. I think in this era, you cannot be involved with any venture unless you have some level of uh, humanitarian interest. It's the right thing to do. The PSF is really crucial to our humanitarian efforts because it lays the groundwork and the support for surgeons to go out there and apply our skills to underserved communities, whether they're domestic or typically abroad. And so the PSF symbolizes the very essence of what we do on a humanitarian level.